NBA is back, and we're about a quarter way through the season. This has been a pretty interesting season so far. Um, I want to dive straight into it because this is the news we just got, right? Like, it happened last night. It was all over the timeline. It was absolutely going crazy. LeBron James and Isaiah Stewart, that whole situation happened, and the fallout was two games for Isaiah Stewart and one game for LeBron James. Is that correct? Yes. How do we feel about that? Uh, personally, not surprised. I mean, like we can get into whether, <clears throat> you know, if we feel like LeBron should have gotten more, cause I feel like that's generally where, um, the discourse is going on Twitter. It's not so much about the Isaiah Stewart portion of it. I, I do think that two games, I thought he'd get at least a game for sure. Uh, two games to me also make sense. I mean, he undoubtedly escalated the situation, whether or not he was just in doing so, like he, you know, was running all over the court, running over people and trying to get at LeBron. So like inevitably, you know, th there's going to be a punishment that's, uh, you know, commensurate with that kind of behavior. But, uh, you know, the, the discussion, the discourse has generally been about the LeBron portion of this and the fact that he only gets one game and uh, the notion that, you know, because he's LeBron, because he's former league MVP and, and his stature in the league that, you know, the punishment is going to be lessened on him. So um, I don't know. Do I feel like, I mean, I think he probably should have gotten two games. That's where I would have had it in my head. So a game, I mean, it is what it is. I'm not surprised. He's LeBron. Mm -hmm. Marco. Yeah, I'm pretty much on the same boat as Ariel. Uh, the thing I'm surprised is that LeBron got didn't get the same amount of games as Stewart. I thought they would get the same amount of games at, mm -hmm. at least because I don't think the league wanted that uh, out there that they're favoring anybody, even just to look like you're favoring anybody. Because I don't think, uh, like me personally, I would have given him uh, two the same as Stewart. Uh, and I don't think Stewart is... <laughs> People were angry at the way Stewart reacted. Uh, mostly, you know, LeBron fans or Laker fans. Uh, I understand where Stewart was coming from, though. Uh, whenever you get hit, I don't think you care about intention, and I don't think that he cared about LeBron wanting to contact him. When you're hit, you don't. At that moment, you're heated enough to react the yeah. way you're going to react. So, uh, to me, I think they should have gotten at least the same amount. I don't know if giving LeBron less than Stewart is going to be a good look on the league. Uh, for me personally. I don't think it's a good look, but you know, that's just me. And let's, and let's real quick, be honest that like that. I think the reason that people are so, uh, you know, kind of up in arms about this is the points that, you know, you mentioned Marco, the things I brought up, but also because like what LeBron did, I mean, he kind of tried to play it off. Like it was not intentional. He's like, Oh, sorry, my guy. Like I didn't mean to do that, but <laughs> that I mean, it was one, it was 100%. 100, 100, 100, 100, like 100, you, you, maybe he didn't intend to hit him in the face, but that sure. was an intention to like bang mm -hmm. him at some point. Like mm -hmm. that's just where he was going with that. Um, but yeah, I agree with you guys. I think uh, I, in an ideal world, LeBron probably gets more than one game. Um, Stewart, it was just funny to me. I was shocked they didn't get more because it looks like he was really trying to escalate the situation. He oh, just yeah. wasn't able to. And it ended up looking really funny. Um, but he definitely was. <laughs> that could have gotten a lot worse. Uh, credit to Cade Cunningham. He was doing a great job of kind of trying to tackle Isaiah Stewart. I haven't seen that type of tackle breaking ability from anyone outside of Derrick Henry and Jonathan Taylor. So. Uh -huh. Um, great, great story. 